Very, very good blocks on both sides. I love the huge cross in Gaffney's helmet. Like he's a crusader from the old times. It's a very classic look. Very classic. Now Simon has actually trained a lot of us in the Salt Lake City Crusaders. He's something of a legend in the sport. Look at that, just, just in time pulling back. So all that energy from that swing didn't even mess with him. That's the first round. Armor by wearing that white smock he has over top. He's also representing his team by wearing that. Look at the wide stance taken by these fighters. So they get a moment's notice, surge forward or back up. Woo, some strong fast hits. There's a new dent on Gaffney's helmet. <laughs> That's a second new dent. He's got to be careful about letting open that right side. Once again, that's why it's so important that these, that all this armor is made with the right material, the right thickness. Now, if you'll notice, Gaffney appears has his right hand on top of his long sword, versus Simon has his right hand on the other side. So they're kind of at opposing odds with their swords. This means that there's sort of forced opening. Simon may have done this on purpose in order to force